show y'all the old hood. They done gentrified it. actually think they know your life better than you do. You know what I'm saying? People assume things about your life. And by the way, today is July the 29th, 2021. You know what I mean? I'm gonna actually today, no cap. None at all. But people, people think that they know your life. They assume they know where you are. They assume that you doing what they think, what they think you doing. But in reality, you just living your own dream. Some history on that. We ain't gonna get into that yet. We ain't gonna get into none of this. But it's just showing you what it is. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Yes, sir. A lot of history. y'all know that no matter if you're doing good or if you're doing bad people still are gonna talk negative about you look at this what the hell is this look at this y'all look at this you know what I'm saying that's off the chain you know what I mean? Like, in the trenches helping people like this daily. You know what I mean? But people assume other things about you. Just a little twirl. It's just a little twirl. We do a lot of work in there too, y'all. We do a lot, a lot, a lot of work in there. We just actually finished some stuff in there earlier this week. That's a um, homeless shelter. It helps majority of the people in the city when it comes to homelessness and um, you know substance abuse and assisting people with the things that they're trying to get. It's kind of a staple of the community. A lot of people definitely depend on it. It's sad, but generations actually depend on it. Uh, just wanted to give y'all a quick little ride 
and just let you know that it will be best with this new energy to focus on the things that can enhance your life versus tearing other people's lives down. It will be wise for you to focus on progression, health, um, progression and finances, not for you, not to spend, but for your next generation to be able to move forward. I don't want to say easier because we don't want to take an easier way, but to have less of a struggle and be able to invest versus build. So with that kind of energy, um, no matter your age, you should be able to progress definitely in the direction that you would uh, see fit according to how long you're willing to endure what you need to endure so you don't quit. We forget life is like climbing the mountain. We can't see the top. We just got to keep climbing. We just know that's the way we're supposed to go. So if you don't elevate up a, a mountain and you stay stagnant, if you don't have the resources to survive, you ain't going to make it. What's the other alternative versus climbing? <clears throat> you could stay stuck. You could stay at the bottom. And that's fine. But just know what comes with that. Things that remain at the bottom will be there. You know? So don't complain about them because they're there. They're there because it's the bottom. And expect that kind of stuff to be at the bottom. Now, there's lessons to be learned in the bottom. I come from the bottom. But once you learn those lessons, you shouldn't just want to waller there. Just stay. You want to actually try to move up the mountain. You don't have to try to climb it all at once. Take baby steps. Some people climb it faster. Some, clean. Some people got more endurance. Some people struggle. Some people got super equipment because they people that climbed it before left them equipment to be able to make it up the mountain easier. That's what we should be doing. That's what I'm talking about when I'm talking about wealth and abundance. It's about elevating your next generation so as they climbing up that mountain, it'll be an easier journey. Now, they won't be as strong as you, but they have a much bigger head start because it won't be as hard. You know what I'm saying? It's like you taking a jetliner to Atlanta or you taking a, a one propeller plane. Like You gonna get there either way, but the jet. Oh yeah, we about to go get some of this. Let's go see what they doing over here. Let's go see what they doing. What are they doing? Listen, do we have time for one more? Guys, one more? I have to show you one more. What are they over there doing? Interesting. Did she have time for one more? I don't know. But yeah, we want to actually leave ropes and equipment behind specifically for our offspring, specifically for people that's coming through our lineage. So as they climb this mountain of life, we could leave clues behind books and, and information and notes and stuff health tips so as they climb in this mountain think about it somebody that's eating unhealthy climbing the mountain versus somebody that's eating healthy climbing who gonna get up there you know what i'm saying who's gonna have the most endurance if the body is built to eat nutrition who's gonna have the most endurance who's gonna have the most capacity within their cell membranes to tap into to make that climb. You know what I'm saying? So, you want to educate. Now, some people put their faith in the higher power to give them strength, which is, you should tap into a higher power. I'm not going to tell you which ones or one or whatever, 
But anything outside of this fleshy body on this planet is definitely something that you should look to tap into. So, but as you climb this mountain, you're going to have people that's hating on you. You think you're doing something. You moving fast. You think you're doing something because you stay at your steady pace. Girl, bye. I'm about to sit on this rock and chill for an hour or two. Chew. Come on, man. See, and, and a lot of a lot of dudes, a lot of dudes is going to be chilling with them. Some people going to be hanging out on rocks like, man, we about to chill right here and throw a party. But everybody going up the mountain, we about to chill right here and throw this party. You know what I'm saying? What's happening at the party? Y'all know what happened at parties. And if the party is good and you ain't got to move, why would you move? So guess what happens? You stay stuck. You've been partying 20 years. Some of them people at that party done moved on. Some of them people done wandered off and said, you know what, man? I'm about to go back down the mountain and kick it at the bottom. You know what I'm saying? I ain't even got the energy. They be like, I'm too old to try to climb this mountain. They be about 28, 30. <laughs> I'm too old to try to climb this mountain. I'm about to go on back down here where it's easy at the bottom. And at the bottom is smoke, but you can navigate through it. Some people that's been constantly climbing find out that the higher you climb, the more luxury you find. So you just gotta climb to a certain level and things get a lot easier. You start making connections with people who've climbed for long periods of time and have made a way for themselves and say, you know what, I'm gonna help somebody else. Once they on a certain level, for you to get their help, you have to climb to a certain level. You can't get it at the bottom. You can't get it in the middle. You have to be toward the top to get that kind of help from a certain level. Then you got people that's plugged in. You got people that all they got to do is connect their harness. You know what I'm saying? Connect their harness. The homeboy banging. Old school. They don't know nothing about that. I gotta put that back on. Put that back on. Oh yeah. There it is. That's that A ball of MJG right there. That's that A ball of MJG. Some of y'all new, some of y'all young people don't know nothing about that A ball of MJG. Y'all don't know nothing about that. He was in there rocking. I could appreciate that. You know what I mean? This is another part of the hood. You know what I'm saying? Up here on Lang Street. It's a lot of things that used to happen up here on Lang Street. There's so much history up here. You know what I mean? So much history up here. I ain't gonna go into detail, but uh, it be cracking. It used to crack and it's still cracking. I mean, that's all I can tell you. But they ginger. We used to hoop over there. We won a tournament over there. We won a basketball tournament over there. Trying to get it in. He trying to catch him one, y'all. Trying to catch him one. This used to be a good church. This was a real good church. You see what they did to the church. That's Cincinnati. I'm gonna just leave it at that. That's Cincinnati. This park used to be super cracking. They done gentrified and cleaned that up. It was clean up or else. All right, let me finish this video, but, um, ooh, can't make it through that. See, back in the day, oh, no, 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 no. Unless you was going to the market, the market is a little food spot where you get fresh food and stuff like that. That did definitely dissipate it. That ain't what it used to be. But, as you can see, 
it's a little different now. That's the market over there. That's the market. Finley Market. See that? Yep. Yeah. A lot of funerals here. A lot of bad memories here. Good memories and bad, but mainly bad over here. Long story short, I'm about to let y'all go. Tomorrow is Friday. Some of y'all get paid. Make sure you enjoy yourself. Make sure you enjoy your money. Ugh, don't forget about your kids. Don't spend it all up at the bar and at the mall. But, um... Is that mail? No, that ain't mail. Is that mail? No. Um... Long story short, the only thing I really want to tell y'all is continue to progress continue to be the best you you could be don't try to be like somebody else be better don't try to just top them you know what I'm saying learn what they know and learn what fits you and get in your own lane get in your own lane Dude, that's why I remain that being said y'all just strolling through the hood, strolling through the, the old neighborhood. Man, look at this graffiti. It didn't used to be like, yikes. They got cameras up now, see that camera? See the camera? That thing used to be right there. They ain't playing no more. They ain't playing no more. All right, y'all. Till next time. Be yourself. Be the best yourself. Holla.